I'm literally in love. This is love. It's really gorgeous out here. Hi guys! Hi guys! Oh my goodness! With the smile on my face, you can see I'm very excited. I'm sorry, Joy! Oh my goodness! I'm really excited. I've not. Uh, been for a while now so i'm really excited to go back and i'm actually going to somewhere i've not been to before so you know as always i get to show you all the exciting things there so if there's anything you want to see you gotta let me know oh guess you took this video if this is your first time on the channel don't forget to subscribe like also that's very important Oh my goodness, rainy day. I'm so tired. I had no idea the journey would be this long. And we wanted to do like a day trip. That would not have worked at all. So I in whole hair. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it well. But we're trying to locate a taxi. Hi guys. So welcome back. Welcome to this video and welcome to Hohoe. You see, I think I'm getting better with the pronunciation. It's not perfect yet. But we're getting there. We're getting there. So yeah, this is Hohoe. Yeah, before I take it to town and show you around this town, let me give you a little backstory of Hohoe Hohoe Municipality. It's one of the 25 administrative districts of the Volta region of Ghana. It was carved out of the former Kwando district, really, leaving Accra, coming all the way to this place. Like, we spent about five to six hours. You were on the journey with me. If you've not watched that, go and watch yesterday's video. Then you see the rest of the journey, how we go to Hohoe in Volta region. So we're on this journey for like five hours, close to six hours. It was really long. So I was thinking we've left all the bigger cities behind because on that vlog, you see that we, we saw a lot of attraction center, all of the popular places. And then we're getting to the outskirts of Ghana. I was thinking, oh, it will just be like smaller villages and small town here. And then we get we, we got to Hohoe. I'm like, what? There's a city as big as this in this area of Ghana. And I've really never seen a video about Hohoe on the internet. I'm like, what? People have to see this. I had no idea, and I, I, I get to learn here that it's one of the biggest cities in the Volta region. So yeah, I'm really excited to to show you around and show you what they get up to here. It was a rainy day, so everywhere is very wet. So bear with me. But yeah, let's get into town. We're going to we're trying to locate a taxi now so we could get into town, and I'll show you Hohoe before we head on to Willy. Willy is where the waterfall is, and I'm really excited to visit the waterfall. Basically. I'm going to show you all of that too, but let me show you Hohoe first. You know, as always on the on this channel, I get to show you the not so popular places. You see all the popular places on the internet, on YouTube, but you don't get to see this part of Ghana. I get to show you the less shown part of Ghana. So I'm excited. Let's go. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe. Let's go. I'm really tired. I really want to get to do this so I can rest a bit. And then we'll, we'll have to explore. I was thinking we'll stay here for a while so we can see. So we'll see what is you can see around before tomorrow. So yeah, I hope you're enjoying this vlog so far. Don't forget to like it. Yes. Oh my goodness, today vlog bar is very. It's somehow. Anyway. You're the magician. When you sit behind me, love you will put everything together. <laughs> Sometimes you go to shoot and you put vlogs together and I'm like, huh? <laughs> I was there. What do you mean? You, yeah, I can do that. That whole vlogging thing. But today, girl, uh, I don't know. I think the, the, the vehicle we took mostly was... Anyway, I'll check on you guys when we get to the hotel. See you guys in a bit. So let me show you around. Ohoy. I'm not pronouncing it. Well. I'm not Ohoy. Anyway. Ohoy. Ohoy. <laughs> you see the name on the, on the screen. Girl, she a whiny for me. Good girl, you are moving naughty. Come, 
have nicotine and tiny. Oh my goodness, this car right? One thing, the first thing I said was when I got this place is giving me the whole Kabeyan Domi as this area. That's if you're in a car, if you're in a car, you live in a car, the Domi market as this area, the Kabeyan and Adenta area. It has similar vibe to this place. I don't know how to explain it very well, but there were a lot of similarities. I was like, are we back in Nakra and I didn't realize, are we in Domi? I we in Kwabena, but yeah, it's fun getting to see the city, how life is here, how everybody is busy. The motor park we just left now has a huge market there. Really, it was so big. It was even bigger than the Domi market. I'm like, what? It's it's a really beautiful place, and it was a rainy day, so everywhere was so bright, and it was really beautiful getting to see the scenery. Can you see the sky? This view, it's so much fun to stick in, and yeah, we're approaching the secretariat. Yeah, this is the government office building, that's the district office building where the workers stay, and we're approaching the head center now. It has a huge head center, like it's a city. Life here, it's like bubbly. It's amazing. If you are planning on visiting the really waterfall, you should plan on visiting Hoi. It's very close to the really town also. You see how big it is here. Just you know, come and experience life here and see how bubbly this town can get. But really so far I'm enjoying it. I hope you're enjoying seeing it through my lenses. You know, let's go. You can have all them drinks upon me. See the girls, them a whine it on me. See the girls, them a whine it on me. Them man, them a moving calmly. Hey. Take the position, I waste no time. Flex your body, make you free your mind. Man, they think about you all the time. Lick up party, make you get that wine. Bad girl, she a whine it on me. Good girl, you a moving naughty. Come have little gin and tiny. It's time for a little party. You can have all them drinks upon me. You can have all them drinks on me. So the girls, them a whine it on me. Them man, them a moving calmly. Me not tell you see me fire can cool. Me not tell you see me nothing can do. But the vibes they never they can do. But the streets they me really can move. Bad girl, she a whine it on me. Good girl, you are moving naughty. Come have little gin and tiny. It's time for a little party. It's time for a little party. You can have all them drinks upon me. You can have all them drinks on me. So the girls, them a whine it on me. Them man, them a moving calmly. That I wasn't able to show you more, but hopefully before we leave, we'll come back here and I get to like go inside inside the town and show you the whole detail. It does if you are interested in seeing that. You know, I know you all love the fact I can show you all of those things. So yeah, let's head on to Uli now. Uli is the next town. It's like a smaller town. It's a small, intimate town. It's where the waterfall is. The Uli waterfall is the highest waterfall in all of West Africa and third in the world. They were coming to that. We are coming to that. We are going to get to. Uh, we are going to get up to a lot of things in Uli. But yeah, we are going to Uli now. And I'm really excited to show you the town. Let me show you how intimate the town is how gorgeous gorgeous the tank is i promise you're going to fall in love with that tank i hope you enjoy seeing her hair so far and now let's head on to really if you're here you're still watching you've not liked the vlog yet come on do me something you know like it engage with the vlog yeah come on let's go it's really exciting we got up to do some 
little bit of girl talk on the way also while sharing. Maybe he appreciates because you are hardworking. But if he wants to get married, so he can live soft life. Yeah, so that he won't be like spending too much money. Maybe you still have your own money to spend. Welcome to Uli. Oh my goodness. Uli is the most gorgeous little town you ever see. Like, I'm not even joking and I'm not exaggerating. It's so gorgeous. The scenery here, the mountain view, everything was so green. There was uh, something going on here. I think they had a burial ceremony. You know, in Ghana, right, when they're doing burial, they wear uh, red and black for their burial. So, you know, you see a group of people gathering. And there's a lot of red and black going on. It's usually a burial ceremony. That's the poster of who died, but I don't know who died yet. I think they were doing like a, the way came to the main burial day because the other the next day they did the whole burial. And the night they did the way came in. But yeah, it's really gorgeous. We're heading to our hotel now. I can't wait. Party. It's time for a little party. You can have all them drinks upon me. You can have all them drinks on me. See the girls, they my wine upon me. See the girls, they my wine upon me. Them man, they my moving calmly. Barbecue on fire, she have to act like the umpire. Dance all around the bonfire. No one cover me now wear wire. It's time for a little party. It's time for a little party. You can have all them bricks upon me. Yeah. Tell us Version of the volcano. It's so beautiful. Right? It's so beautiful. Oh my god. There's a cat coming. How is it true? <laughs> right? I'm literally in love. This is love at first sight. Love at first sight. Would you really want to live here for a bit? Oh my goodness. It's really it's amazing here. Yeah. So we got into our hotel. But we're not inside here. We're just outside, just taking in the the amazing views. Like it's this. Andrea is looking for someone that will uh, take a picture for for her. So yeah. We literally spent a couple of minutes here just doing foreign aspects. Basically Andrea and I. And Stella was such a good sport. You know she's the genie and she's been here several times. And I love the fact that she just let us be our foreigners and literally we were literally so excited to be here because it was so gorgeous. We feel like we're in Switzerland. Maybe we're in Switzerland. I don't know. <laughs> I'm just saying, but yeah, it was really nice of Stella to just let us be us for a bit and act like foreigners. And the whole people in the village, as the villagers, were just staring at us and they were smiling because obviously I think they've seen a lot of people come there 
and see how gorgeous their little tan is and they are like oh starstruck doing all of these whole foreigner things you know visitor thing we are doing so i think they, they were mostly amused by us but we did that for a bit before we head into our hotel so let's go i can just imagine the kind of things i can do here Time for a little party. A mansion, obviously. You can have all your eggs upon me. It is really gorgeous. Actually. Check it out. Oh my goodness, we're coming. Hey guys, so welcome to. I don't know if it will be another vlog, but whatever it is, this is where we're putting up for the weekend. I'm really excited, yes, true. So I'm really just quickly going to walk around to what we have to do. And then we'll get going for the fun. I'm really hungry. So the energy is not there yet. So we have this double, what's about? I think this is 25. Or the foreigner. This is for the game, yeah. <laughs> this is for Andrea and I. This is for Stella. They have this phone. I think it has AC. AC is in the Take the position now, we have to do hair, laundry, and the rest of that. Yeah, it's really cute. I like it so far. I was expecting something quite different. But yeah, okay. And then this is the restroom. I think I'll do it all for you guys. You know, I always deliver. And then they have a water in town. That's nice. And it's huge, so I think there will be no more water for us. So yeah. Okay. Yeah.